Hey YouTube, it's Scrap Diva 29 I want to wish you a Happy New Year. Um, I've been busy. I haven't made any videos, but I have been scrapbooking, and I want to share with you this photo folio that I made. Um, all right, let's open it up. I used magnetic closure, so this is what it looks like as you open it up. I will do one side at a time because it actually extends um, quite a bit. And this first page right here is a pocket page. This paper is so pretty. It's gold. I know it has a little bit of probably some shine to it. I'm not sure if you can see the glare, but um, it's really pretty and it's nice and smooth. It was, I really enjoyed working with this paper. It's just really nice. Um, this is all I want for Christmas, journaling on this page. As you open it up, you can see right here we've got a pocket, which this slides out for photos. Slide that back in. And then this page, I'm just gonna fold this like this. It'll be easier for me to show. Um, this page right here has that waterfall effect with a bunch of photos that slide in. This slides all the way in here like this. And then you see each one has a little pocket and they get a little bit smaller in size, but you can add your photos and again. And this last, oh, actually there's one more. That one folds out for even smaller. They gradually get smaller. I think this one would be great for journaling or putting the event or time and place of the pictures up here. And sliding over to this page, it was just a, a page where I just added uh, some uh, a place for a photo and just added this little tag that came in the collection. All right, so I'm gonna go on to the other side, fold that back in, and I just left this blank. I kind of, I followed this tutorial and I didn't follow it correctly. I still like the way it came out, but I don't like the way the album closes, as you will see when you open it up. Um, this opens up to another pocket and slide this out for a photo. Another pocket page, one, two, three pockets for photos. And they all gradually get bigger and bigger. And closing this side, another pocket page where this slides out for photo journaling. And this page right here, sorry about that. This is hard to hold and show at the same time. Uh, another folo uh, waterfall for more pictures. And another spot for a picture. As you can see, I did not put very many embellishments, actually little to none. I probably could add some stamping or couple more punches here and there and I might as I decide to decorate with photos I might add a couple things but you really can't add too much to these water folios or photo folios because then it won't close properly but this is my mini photo folio I did use super happy scrappers tutorial um, if you do look at her tutorial on this, make sure you watch it first before you make it. That way you can kind of figure it out as you go and you won't make the mistake I did because I think in hers, she had her waterfall on this page, which makes sense. That way when you close it up, you don't have it. It's not so fat on this page and it'll close properly. See how this side closes nice and flat and this side's all bulky because of the, because of this fold, this waterfall that I made right here. But anyway, it, it came out cute. Um, I'll probably make another one, try it again. But it was fun. I hope you enjoyed and I will be posting some more videos soon. I will see you later.